The Duke of Sussex used to end royal tours by meeting with the press to discuss ideas. Prince Harry's criticism towards the media has not always been there, according to royal photographer Arthur Edwards who recalled how the royal used to interact with journalists on royal tours. He told Fox News, at the end of our trip to Colorado Springs, Harry said, I'll meet in the pub tonight, 6 p.m. and we all met at the pub. He turned up, and we had an hour and a half of exchanging ideas, exchanging viewpoints but there was a lot of laughter as well. And at the end of it all, Harry picked up the tab. We did that there, we did that in Australia, we did that in Jamaica, we did that everywhere we went with him. With Meghan, it all stopped overnight. And I feel sad about that because Harry had a great relationship with the media. Has a gifted young man who was so engaging with people. He could get things off his chest, and you didn't take offense. You could do the same, and he wouldn't take offense. When I look at him now, he just seems so unhappy. But Harry said he feels it's his duty to uncover the exploitation and bribery within the media who know the full truth. The first three episodes of Harry and Meghan's Tell, all Netflix documentary begin with the Duchess of Sussex accusing the media of wanting to destroy her and claiming salacious stories were planted by the press. Harry also spoke of the harassment his mother Princess Diana suffered in the fear that Meghan would also be driven away by the media. In the opening of the first episode, the Duke said, So like duty and service and I feel as though being part of this family it is my duty to uncover this exploitation and bribery that happens within our media. Meghan said, Unfortunately, in us standing for something, they are destroying us. As the piano music continued to play, Harry said, This isn't just about our story. This has always been so much bigger than us. No one knows the full truth. We know the full truth. The institution knows the full truth. And the media know the full truth because they've been in on it. And I think anybody else in my situation would have done exactly the same thing. The documentary appeared to link the EU referendum to a culture war in the UK at the time of Harry and Meghan's engagement in 2017. Speaking about the press coverage of her, Meghan said, At that point, I was still very much believing what I was being told, which was it will pass it will get better, it's just what they do right at the very beginning. This promise of once you're married, don't worry, it'll get better, once they get used to you it'll get better, of course it'll get better. But truth be told, no matter how hard I tried, no matter how good I was, no matter what I did, they were still going to find a way to destroy me.